So that looks cool, but what does this tablet actually do? I tried to use it mostly for home automation status at a glance, which is especially helpful when leaving or coming home. So on my main screen, I have the time, the weather, alarm status, garage door status, HVAC status, and a couple camera feeds. I'm not controlling much on the main screen, but I've got controls to close the main garage door and a macro to turn off all lighting in the house. So to control any specific device, I'd have to open a subscreen. I've got screens to find for upstairs, main level, outside, and for power usage. This whole project really is about standing upon the shoulders of giants. So the part that actually makes this work as a dashboard is the web interface. It's using dashing as the, uh, the framework. And so over on the OpenHob community forum, there's a thread started by S. Smar, Smar, however you pronounce that. And he started this really cool um, dashboard. And so over on his GitHub page, it's pretty decent. And looking specifically at the Android tablet notes, that's great but I wanted just a little bit more. So the next logical step here is an Android app that manages the Android web view. And that's what this video is about, specifically with the Amazon 7-inch Fire Tablet, the $50 version that goes on sale pretty regularly. I've made two videos on the tablet part of this project, one for rooting and ROMing the tablet and one for configuring the software on the tablet. If you set one of these up, let me know. I'd love to see your install. Thanks for watching.